Nine billion dollars. That's how much the Pentagon just gave Amazon, Google, Oracle, and Microsoft to create the world's best cloud. In this video, I'm going to show you how this could be the biggest opportunity for your cloud career. And if you've been watching our channel, you know that we've been telling you for two years why you need to become a multi-cloud architect. In fact, we have been exclusively teaching our students for two years why it's important to know the cloud versus any specific cloud provider. And if all you know is what's taught in certifications, prepare for the death of your cloud career. Why? 80% of customers use more than one cloud, but that's before this. But this big news changes everything. In fact, I've been designing mission critical systems for over 25 years and there's one cardinal rule. No single points of failure and never a single service provider. But if you're a multi-cloud architect, this $9 billion project is the opportunity of a lifetime. This $9 billion project will create an incredible number of cloud computing jobs. And since multi-cloud is a specialty, it will pay far more because of the scarcity of capable and qualified multi-cloud architects. Let me show you why a multi-cloud architecture is the only acceptable solution for the United States and its defense program. As the Navy SEALs say, two is one and one is none. Let's face it, a single cloud is a single point of failure. And if the United States government was dependent upon a single cloud and that cloud were to go down, the entire United States could be destroyed in less than 30 minutes from a nuclear attack. So imagine the trauma, the death and destruction that could occur if the United States entire defenses relied on a single cloud. Imagine drones falling out of the sky, landing on people's houses. Imagine not being able to respond to oncoming attacks. Imagine intelligence systems being down. And any failure that could take down a cloud could take down the entire United States defenses. What does it take to take down an entire cloud? One of three failures. Imagine a major network failure that can take down a cloud, a hacking event that can easily take down a whole cloud, or a control plane failure can take down an entire cloud. Now you may ask, what is the control plane failure? There is an orchestration component of the cloud that makes sure everything works and works smoothly. If that goes down, the entire cloud goes down. Now, you think cloud outages are rare? No, not at all. Let's discuss just some of the cloud outages that have occurred in just the last 12 months. On December 7th, 2021, AWS had a major catastrophic outage for nearly seven hours. That's enough time for a full-scale invasion to occur. On December 15th, 2021, AWS had an outage that lasted 30 minutes. It took down Twitch, DoorDash, Xbox Live, PlayStation Network, Ring, Disney Plus, and T-Mobile, all major companies. That's enough time for millions of lives to be lost. And on December 22nd, 21, AWS had another outage which lasted 60 minutes. This time it took down Fortnite, Hulu, Quora, Slack, and Imgur. Again, big organizations. And again, enough time for millions of lives to be lost. But it's not just AWS. On March 8th, 2022, Google Cloud had an outage for two hours and 35 minutes. And it took down tech giants such as Spotify and Discord. And on June 9th, 2022, Google had a network failure, a cable cut that took down pretty much the entire Middle East for over two hours. The only possible solution is a multi-cloud architecture. Now I've given you just a few examples. Imagine if the US relied on a single cloud, that cloud would be the highest value target for hackers in the entire world. Now, how long do you think it would take a coordinated effort from multiple governments to take down a single cloud? Now imagine those governments spend $50 billion to hack down a single cloud. How long do you think it would take to take down a single cloud? So we are very excited to see the United States use a multi-cloud architecture. Before this news, 81% of organizations use more than one cloud. Now after this, it's a game changer. The precedence is set, the future is multi-cloud. So if you wanna earn more in your career, learn multi-cloud. If you want a better cloud career, learn multi-cloud. Learn how to make your customers more successful and the rewards will follow. If you'd like to learn how to get your first multi-cloud architect job, please attend our free webinar on how to get your first cloud architect job. The link is in the description below. 
And if you'd like to learn how to build your cloud career, join us several times per week on our free cloud career question and answer sessions. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel.